So this is our new 117 unit multifamily purchase. These are our property managers. This is Katina. She is the owner of Sweetwater Property Management. This is Darlene. She is the in-house property manager. So the way that it works is Katina owns a property management company and Darlene works for her in our leasing office. So they're my barrier as a property owner to the tenants. So I manage from a higher level. I, I work with them on budgets and what we're doing with the tenants, but I'll never directly speak to a tenant. They're on the front line and I'm behind them behind the scenes. Like I said, managing budgets, managing tenants from a real high level, you know, what we're doing with new leases, where the new lease prices are going, what do we do with tenants that have been here for a long time? If there's some tenants behind on rent, what are we gonna do with them? Are we gonna, you know, give some people a break? Are we gonna charge lay fees? And just overall structure of how the whole thing works is gonna be on my side and they're my frontline defense. So if we ever need anything at the property, I could call Katina or Darlene directly. Darlene's gonna be actually on site. Katina man manages from a higher level than Darlene, so she's in charge of getting contractors here if we need, or she's in charge of the accounting of the property. Um, all the property accounting is actually done at the property manager level, and then it comes down to us in a very simple form. So all the income and expenses actually go through Katina, and we basically get one, uh, one distribution from Katina after all the, all the income was taken in or, or after all the expenses were taken out of that, we then get a distribution from Katina and then from that we actually pay our investors uh, the 70-30 split. So our investors own 70% of this, we own 30% and we do the distributions after Katina is done taking in all the money, spending everything that she needs to and that's it, that's how it goes.